Here's a quick scan of Dave's workshop with just a few of his toys. He's going to show you how he uses or gets on most of them. So the first one he's getting on is just a regular lawn tractor. Notice he puts his right foot up just to give him a little extra height just to help with the lift. And he actually makes it look very simple. It does take some practice though. Now from talking to Dave, this type of lawn tractor works well, but there is a problem if you ever get your lawn more stuck or run out of gas, then you have your wheelchair nowhere in sight, so you're in a little bit of a jam. So after this lawnmower, he graduated to the zero turn lawnmower. So this is that special zero turn lawnmower, which actually has space for him to put his wheelchair. So he just hops over onto the front of that uh, lawnmower and he has to be very careful not to damage his skin over the lip. Now you really can't tell, Dave actually tends to wear two pairs of pants. He usually wears a pair of um, jogging pants underneath his pants just to give his skin a little extra protection because he does do a lot of transfers that are out of the ordinary. Notice when he was getting up onto the seat, he put his feet as close to his bum as he could and leaned really far forward. Very much uh, the same transfer as trying to get up off the floor back into your chair. He's repositioning himself, taking his time so he doesn't fall forward to bring his wheelchair up onto the lawnmower. And therefore, wherever he goes, he has the wheelchair with him. We decided to show you this transfer from a different angle just to show his beautiful lift up into the seat. He brings his feet back to help keep his balance. He does that really far lean forward, which if you had shorter arms, this could be a problem. Hangs on for support and he lifts the wheelchair up so it's with him. And here he just lowers the wheelchair down in front of him, basically just the reverse of what we already saw. Does a really gentle lift, putting himself onto the front of the tractor. Puts his feet down. Again, being careful to lift up over the lip there so he doesn't hurt his skin. And he's done. Now, after those two lawnmowers, I guess Dave thought that wasn't enough, so he got a big tractor. Notice he put his feet up on his foot strap, actually, to give him a little extra height for the lift. He lifts up onto the floor of the tractor. We wouldn't recommend this for beginners, and again, Dave's wearing two pairs of pants to protect his skin in case he scrapes his bottom a little bit. Um, he does really big transfers, though, so he tends to be very gentle. This is like a three or four step transfer. <laughs> Keeps getting himself up higher, getting his feet in close to his bum so he can lift, lean forward, and into the seat. Safety. Yeah, and lowers himself gently onto the floor, brings his feet back down. And he got a big lift into his chair.
Now this is Dave's Kubota. For this transfer, he lifts his feet up into the floor, onto the floor of the Kubota. And uh, he basically does a transfer similar to getting into a truck. So he puts his feet in and then does a huge lift up. His little armrest that he has to lift up over. So it's difficult but doable for him. And notice his skin is in good shape. He didn't hit anything on the way up. Ever conscious of safety. <laughs> Now getting out, Dave does something a little bit different. He actually is about to lower himself down onto the floor to make the transfer a little more manageable. He has very strong arms, so he can lower himself down very slowly. And from there, he gets to the edge of the door frame. I think he got his pants stuck there. <laughs> he did. And then out. Stuck on the parking brake. You may get a little glimpse of some of the race cars that Dave works on. One's actually accessible so he can drive it. He also has motorbikes that he works on because he's a mechanic.